All right, Piggy fans, who the holidays are here, so that means we get new Piggy items to open up, including, wow, check this out, a gift pack full of Piggy action figures. Ooh, Piggy action figures. Oh, I see zombies in there. Ooh, I love zombies. Zombie Piggy. <laughs> oh, Zombie Steve, you and zombies. Yep, I see a couple of them in there, and we'll open all these and more. Because not only are we checking out the entire Series 2 Piggy set, but we've got also got this as special edition collector's pack, which gives us some rare figures that you can't find anywhere else. So, yeah, we got some cool stuff coming at ya. But all right, Series 2 with Piggy. Oh, I can't wait because looks like we get 10 minifigures in this item instead of getting them in blind boxes this time around. And I am super excited because it comes in this awesome Piggy carrying case. Nice, and I told Fat Mojo, I was like, you gotta start doing gift packs of these things. Because, ugh, it looks like they took my idea, which is awesome, because yeah, now we got cool gift packs like this. All right, and the first one I guess we'll get out because Zombie Steve can't wait is, ugh. All right, here we have the first pan figure, which is the Zomb Piggy. All right, cool, this is a really awesome character of a, wait a minute, last week we opened this Zomb Pig Heady thing, and we also got one of these figures too. So are you telling me this is the same exact figure? Oh, look at that, it is. Oh, I thought this was gonna be an exclusive figure that you can only get in this Zomb Piggy head. Oh, for crying out loud, man. I can't believe we got two Zomb Piggies now. Oh, I don't mind, I love Zomb Piggy. <laughs> yeah. Well, of course you like it, but I hate duplicates. All right, well, I guess we'll have to live with one duplicate because there are 10 in this set, and if that's the only one, well, that's just fine by me. All right, let's get out this other figure right here, which is, oh, check this out. This is mechanical little mousy looking dude. Wow, that's cool. I love that little gear sticking out of his ear there. That's pretty nice. And we got some hands that are kind of like digger hands. So cool, and we get the little mousy tail on back with some fins on the back too. All right, let's get another figure out of here and keep the cool guys coming. And next up, oh man, it's that woofy guy. Oh, he looks cool too. <laughs> I love that expression on his face. That looks great. He's got a dart gun in his hand. And I love getting characters like this because well, we haven't gotten them in the action figure form yet or the constructor set form yet. So nope, he's exclusive only to this little miniature figure line, just like this mousy guy. All right, we've got a ton of other figures to look at, and uh, looks like we've got a great lineup here, including this guy here, which, oh, it looks like a little koala bear. <laughs> Boy, is that awesome, or what? Kind of looks like a construction worker. See, he's got some weird things on that side of his face. He's got a mace in one hand. Oh, well, mace in both hands. So he can climb you up, blah, blah. So come here, duplicate zombie piggy. Blah, blah. <laughs> Take care of you, blah. It looks like a lot of these guys have a hard time standing. So I'm not sure uh, why Fat Mojo can't fix that. But yeah, the mo mousy guy, yeah, he doesn't stand really well, as does this guy. Well, at least they look cool. So, all right, let's get out this next guy here. Ooh, he's a raccoon and he's a robber, it looks like. <laughs> he kind of reminds me of Swiper from Dora. Do it, Swipe Swiper! <laughs> uh, look at that cool crowbar. Oh, that's neat. He's got the uh, robber mask on and satchel to put over his back there for swiping things. Cool, let's see if he stands. Oh, he does! Aw, oh, bonus! Okay, let's keep the cool train going. Uh, with this next figure. Uh, which is, okay, let's see what this is. Oh man, I think this is another duplicate? Let's see, compared to the other piggy, and no, I guess not. So this looks like a different piggy altogether. It's translucent as you can see there, and the bottom part is red instead of brown. So uh, yeah, I haven't played the game, so I'm not sure if this is a different character or not, but kind of looks like it for me, maybe like a younger sister or something. I'm not sure, but <laughs> it looks like we've got one more left in this pack here. Ugh. And ooh, we finally get Clowny. Oh, no, that's what I'm talking about. Get out of here, guys. <laughs> Clowny, that big old hammer thing that he's got. Big old red fluffs of hair popping out the back. Oh, I gotta like that. And his, his whole outfit's just amazing. I love it. And I thought this was gonna be a duplicate at first, but nope, I guess not. It just seems that way because, well, we've gotten a regular clowny action figure and a clowny construction figure, which put all these guys together. And yeah, we've got now three clownies in each different lineup of figures. 
And of course, boom, once we start getting into the little gift pack, check that out. Ooh, we get an exclusive clowny right here. Let's see, open this. So this is gonna be quite the clowny Christmas. All right, let's get this guy out first and check this guy out. All right, so if we put them side by side, looks like we get two versions of this guy. This guy's wearing all red, where this guy is wearing all blue. And, oh, the noses are different as well. Cool, and oh, the hammers are different as well. So this guy's got a square one, where this guy's got a circle one. All right, so all kinds of differences. All right, so before digging into these mystery figures and figuring out what those are, I do want to see what these figures, the rest of these figures are in the gift pack. Ooh, these things are flying all over the place because I, I think these are all duplicates because I know we've gotten him before, Tigri. And here's a Tiger we've got in the Series 1 blind bag. And as you can see, it looks like the same figure, only with different colored shirts. If we go back to the box here, okay, we get another piggy with a, ooh, a black shirt. Duplicate from Series 1. So there's the regular piggy. It looks like the dress is different. And then the last character we get is the soldier piggy. And here's the regular soldier from series one. And as you can see, yep, looks like a uh, color scheme change as well for the outfit. This one's green, that one's black. Eyes are different, helmets are different. Wow, they did a, a lot of different things with this character. So, all right, Picket fans, now time for the moment of truth. Time to see what's in these mystery figure bags. And we've got three of them. So let's get started with the first one. And on the table, we'll deposit our goods and Oh man, it's the robot pig! Oh, check it out! Oh, that is awesome! But wait a minute! Oh man, if we look at series one, looks like we already had a robo pig! Oh, darn it, but it looks like this one is even better because it's all shiny. Oh, cool. So yeah, I think I like that when it comes to Robo Piggy. But we've got all these lines covered. Let's see, there's the construction line and then the action figure line. Okay, so time for our second mystery Piggy figure. You know, I can't wait to see what this one is. Ah, so let's, and this time, oh man, it's, <laughs> oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. It's the Frost Piggy, we finally got it. But, uh, oh man, it looks like a clear Frost Piggy. If we compare it to the one that we already have in the action figure line, yeah, we see that they are totally different piggies. Our versions of the Frost Piggy coming at ya. And then the last bonus figure we get here. Ah, oh, give me something good, will ya? So let's open this up and dump this out and drum roll. Uh, what is this? Oh man, a skeleton piggy! Wow, that is so cool. So yeah, this is a figure that is brand new to all three lineups. Oh, I'm so glad I opened this last because this is a great way to finish the episode. Yeah, the skeletal piggy. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. I love the expression on his face. All right, guys, with that, there are all the new figures that we opened up today. We get 10 in the exclusive minifigure pack for Series 2, and then we've got that extra one from Series 1 and a half. And if you want any of these figures for your very own, make sure you check out GameStops and Targets, and yeah, I think you'll find most of that stuff at those places. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. We're out of here.